In 750, the Abbasid Caliphate overthrew the Umayyad Caliphate and took control of the Islamic world. The revolution began in Kufa and quickly spread across Iran and Mesopotamia. Abu al-Abbas as Safa became the first Abbasid Caliph. The new dynasty focused on building a more inclusive government and fostering cultural development. However, the Abbasid Caliphate faced immediate challenges. Internal divisions and the need to consolidate power led to conflicts with various military factions. The Battle of the Zab in 750 was a decisive victory for the Abbasids against the Umayyads, solidifying their rule. The Abbasids also confronted the Shia Muslims, who had supported their rise to power but soon felt betrayed. The caliphs began to persecute the Shia, leading to widespread unrest. One notable conflict was the uprising of Alid Shiites in 762, which the Abbasids brutally suppressed. In the 11th century, the Abbasid Caliphate clashed with the Seljuk Empire. The Seljuks, initially serving as military protectors, gradually took control of the Caliphate's territories. The Battle of Dandanakan in 1040 marked the Seljuk victory over the Ghaznavid Empire, which further weakened the Abbasids' influence. The 13th century brought the greatest challenge the Mongol invasion. Led by Hulagu Khan, the Mongols sacked Baghdad in 1258, effectively ending the Abbasid Caliphate. The city was destroyed, and the Caliph was executed marking a significant turning point in Islamic history. The fall of the Abbasids symbolized the end of a major era of Islamic unity and the beginning of a period of fragmentation and Mongol dominance. The Abbasid Caliphate's history is marked by both incredible achievements and devastating challenges. Their legacy includes significant advancements in science, culture, and governance, but their fall underscores the fragility of even the most powerful empires.